All right, y'all, we got another banger for you guys. Wack 100 talking about 6ix9ine saying they were all rats. It wasn't just 6ix9ine. Wack says the streets is selective politicking, blaming only 6ix9ine for all the snitching that took place. I'm definitely curious to hear your thoughts about it. Let me know in the comments section below. We finna get right into the audio salute to 100 ENT. I'll leave a link for that clubhouse in the description below. Let's get with this audio. Drop a like, drop a sub if you can. Let's get with it. What was going through your head when you thought you wasn't gonna never see her again? Give me the pain, nigga. How'd you feel when you heard your mother from wire recordings of them snaking on you and lining you up? Give me that pain. I wanna hear that. I swear to God, he told that bitch on my phone. I'm on three way. And I got nigga six nine came back with a pain song. The only one he ever did. It made me pull over when he sent it yeah. to me. Pull over. I said, damn. I just said some real shit. First pain song he done did. NBA. I heard it. He pulled it out of me. I got it. You think he gonna rebrand himself? I don't know. He's supposed to be coming to see me this week. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna call it and. and I'm gonna I'm I'm call that man. Tell him let me run with one of them. I don't me. think he should, though. I feel how he is now. That's hot. This no, he's said, Tell me how I came home. Wait, tell me how I rather came home to a big bag. Like, his troll shit is fire. He go, yeah. No, he's not finna change up what he do, but I don't know where, where he going. I know, you know, he's gonna be my, um, he's gonna be my, uh, he's gonna do my diapers for, um, the whole Latin area in Mexico. You know Damn, I mean? that's a mother plug right there, boy. Shit. I don't know what these talking about. You two gangsters for whack. Y'all two gangsters. I'm over here. I'm gangster business. Business gangster. Yeah, there we go. Business gangster. Business, and then the gangster gonna protect when you come in with the business. That's my man. Business gangster. I ain't gangster business. The gangster ain't gonna stop me from doing business. That's how. Cause I don't do no gangster business anyway. Anybody know me? Who in here, Bodine and them niggas? Ask them, you come right. Lati, Lati, come off the mic, watch this. Lati brought his ass out here to LA, kicked it with me in my studio. He said, whack, I'm trying, I know y'all. I say, here go a phone number and I'm out. Ask that, did I go to a beat? Lati, <laughs> how fast did I run? Hey, how fast did I leave the studio, nephew? Hey, hey, you let me go ahead and do my thing. And then when I came back to you and tried to tell you what I was doing, you cursed me out. Like, I don't want to hear nothing about that. All right, man. Say no hey, more. mention anything illegal about some revenue. What? Get the place with me. And I'm running across the street while I'm saying it. Where you going? You're over here. Hey, this is 6 9 is still in the headlines, y'all. Order to pay 100K. We got to pay. Nah, tell us about it. He got to pay 100K to the 9 Trey blood robbery victims which huh? one who, let me who's see the, who's the victims though nine trade the... robbery victims um yes. six nine has Rob been ordered <laughs> by a judge to pay two victims of a 2018 robbery um perpetrated by oh, all the dude that the, the backpack the backpack the the, the, the huge he used to run with before he nah was there, nah they robbed it they ran into the uh the label or something and they took the backpack and all kinds of shit laptop and shit. Yeah, they, they showed it they showed it when they um <laughs> They ran in the lobby on the mix. Mm. They ran down, but see, watch this. This is another thing I be telling you. You know why 6 9 is ordered to pay? Because the motherfucking street told that he the one told him to go do it. Hey, mm. I want to talk about what he did and he admit what he did. Right. So nobody want to talk about how they didn't have 40 something counts because the street was in there telling, singing the blues. That's crazy, bro. Mm. Let me pause the audio real quick. Is this facts? Is the street selective politicking? Do we only blame 6 9 for everything that went down? Y'all let me know your thoughts about that in the comment section. I'm gonna let the audio continue to play out to the end from here. It's definitely some interesting audio. Let's get with it. That's why I don't I'll be like, be like, look, bro, he telling you he told. 6 9 counts came from them telling on him too. All of them snitches. But they don't wanna talk about that. You mentioned one of them other, they wanna fight you. Hey, keep New York business out your mouth. Well, you telling me, bro, you mad at me because I'm doing business with that toe. Okay. But you you defending the nigga that told on him. I'm confused. Back, gang. Yeah. No, that is fair game. They all rats. So you can't all decide, which, rats. You can't decide which rat you want to do business with and which one get a pass. That's not Every right. Single all one of them. them. That's the thing about it, right? Like, he tell you what he did. Do they not see I have 40 count? Did like, yo, I don't know nothing I did, but I be tripping because I have 40 counts from them telling on me. When they told on me, I was in the trick bag, so I told. I know it ain't right, and I told. Tell me I told. But as soon as you mention this, it is good told. They be like, nah, nah, yo, hold up. That's the homie. I'm like, bro, how did the 6 9 get the 40 count? I saw producing paperwork. 
the cool to be, they go crazy over him. We we bring the paperwork. That's how Max really real lost his name. Defending this nigga, fuck for me. I said, bro, right here go the paperwork. This cool to be said that Daniel Gonzalez, aka six Daniel Hernandez, aka six nine, paid mm. him to have somebody go fire shots at Chief Keith in front of the W Hotel. Yo, whack, mm. he had to cop out though. Copping out ain't telling what another told you to do. Copping out is telling them what you did. It's crazy. That's a fact. That's a fact. It's different. Look, he don't, one thing about it. I said, well, he said, whack. I told, I did this. I chose me and my family over them. He said, this is the way I seen it, bro. He said, I had the mentality to stand strong and all that until they press play. I said, what you hear? He said, whack. I'm hearing this lining me up to rob me. Then I hear them setting up the lie to tell me they gonna go get my jury back because I don't know they the ones robbed me. Then I hear them talking about, I'm gonna go tell his baby mama this so I can curse. I'm gonna send him these pictures and videos of him with this other bitch talking to her. Then I hear him plotting on my mom's, her crib. He said, I wasn't finna do that time for them. Straight up. That's what he said. Take it how you want to take it, bro. Yeah, I would have did the same shit. That's what nigga said. And I, I looked at him. Hey, and I looked at him. I like, he said, whack. But no way I was finna go do life for these niggas. say, for my kids. When I'm listening to these niggas who I put money in their pocket, he said these was broke. So I don't want to hear all that Jim Jones, Mel Murder was sleeping on the floor. You know what I'm saying? These was fucked up and broke. I was taking these across the world. Them niggas play whack. He said, whack, you know the only reason why they came and served the warrant? Because they heard him on the phone finna come try to kill me up in Connecticut. They was gonna mm. finna come try to rob me. That mean all this time. That's why they came and picked everybody up that day. He said, man, they press play. All this shit I'm giving these. Yo, what? Hey, listen, man. Just want this much for the jury back. We gotta pay these to go. But I'm giving these this money to go get my shit back. And up in the who I'm giving the money is the ones got my shit. He said, whack that. Mm. I ain't that gangster. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I ain't that gangster. I tell everybody, man, the streets is, um, who's the big homies? He's just over here and he can't even read and write. He calling this your big homie. Trying to tell you what to do. He can't even tell it. He can't even help his own son with homework. Because it didn't bid 10 years because he had to and got some muscles and some braids and a tattoo on his face. Man, mother them, man. 6 9 and all the publicity behind them definitely changed the game. Is snitching the new wave out there? Are folks just prone to snitching right now? Y'all let me know your thoughts about that in the comment section below. This was definitely some crazy audio. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Keep it locked right here at One Minute Hip Hop because we got a bunch more audio coming your way. Drop a like, drop a sub on your way out. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Easy, y'all. Huh?